Hey guys, welcome back to Cryptic Mining. Today I just wanted to go over my setup, what I'm running, uh, all my cards, uh, you know, how we have the power set up over here, how we're trying to disperse heat, uh, how many mega hashes I'm getting, and obviously how much Ethereum I'm pulling in a month at this time. Okay, so guys, I'll start off with this rig here. So these are all ASS GeForce RTX 3070s. Um, Obviously, I've got these running at about 61 mega hashes a card. So we've got 16 cards all together, as you can see there. Okay, and obviously these are all running at about 120 watts each. So that's pretty good for me. You know, we're probably pulling about 2100 watts, including the motherboard all up just for this rig. So that's really good. Um, obviously, you know, I, I, I'm in Australia. So, you know, obviously I've got a 240 volt line. So we're not running 120 volt like some places. Um, so bringing you over to my next rig. So this rig here is a same cards. So same ASS RTX cards. I did get lucky. Um, and these cards are actually 3080s. I don't know if you can, no, I probably can't get the thing off there, but these are all 3080s. So we have eight, 16, 24, oh wait, sorry, no. This card right here is probably the only card out of the bunch that is not a 3080. This card here is a 3070. Obviously, because I built this to hold 24 cards, um, and I couldn't get another 3080 at the time, so I ordered another 3070. So this is uh, 23 3080s and one 3070 in it, as where this is 16 3070s. All right, guys, so how many mega hashes is 3070 rig making at the moment? So this is just making shy of about one giga, yeah, one giga hash. Okay, so this is just shy of one giga hash. Now this, this rig here, so split it right down the middle. Okay, so we have four, eight, 12 cards over here and we have another 12 over there. This side here is connected to one motherboard. And then we have the other side connected to another motherboard, all running on the same rig. Why did I do that? Because it's, I could save more room by doing this and obviously I just wanted to have a bigger rig, okay? So now obviously this side here with the one that has one 3070 in it is currently running at about 1.16 giga hashes. And this one over here is running at 1.2 giga hashes. Sorry, 1.19 gigahertz, which is just shy of 1.2. Okay, so obviously we've got 12 cards there, we're running at about 99.9 mega hashes a card on this side. Now that's pretty good. Uh, now obviously the power consumption for these, as you can imagine, we're running, I think all together, I think all together we're, we're, we're sitting just below 8,000 watts. Running all motherboards, all cards, everything. So I, 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 I think that's pretty good. Obviously I had to get some electrical work done for that. Um, I had to get some new fuses put in. Um, those fuses are obviously, uh, I'm pretty sure they're 25 amps each. So we've got 50 amps of power just over here. Obviously we're not using all of that, but obviously I wanted to make room so that in the future we could obviously increase our rigs and make more rigs. Um, yeah, so guys, I hope that you guys like my rigs. Let me know in the comments what you think. Um, oh, sorry, I've totally forgot to mention. So my 3070 rig right here is running off three different power supplies. So we've got one power supply over here. So this one here is a 1200 watt power supply. This is running the motherboard and only three, four cards, I believe, sorry. It's running about four cards. This this one here is a 1600 watt, the same as this one. So these two are identical. These both are a 1600 watt power supplies. These power supplies are running at about 80%. No, sorry, less than that. These, these are probably running at about 50% 50, 50 each because they're repairing every other card. Um, so there's a lot of room to move there. I do need to rewire this rig in the future, which I will make a video on because obviously this is the first rig that I built. Um, obviously there was a lot of learning curve there, but I need to actually rearrange some of the power cords for all the power supplies because when um, the unfortunate things happen for when Ethereum moves the proof of stake and Ethereum's unmonable, I need this these cards to be able to power up correctly because I believe that I've got this power supply here running at about Oh, so that one's at about 50, no, sorry, that one would probably be about 40%. This one's probably about 80%. So I need to even the load between those two so I can get these cards up to about 180 watts. So we can drop mine Ravencoin 
an Evo on the new Fire POW. Um, so I'm kind of looking forward to that one. I really want to get this rig set up for that. So we'll look at that in the future as well. This one here, obviously, I kept that in mind. So this, this one here can run, you know, the full, you know, nearly 300 watts of card if it needs to. Um, but what I've got down here, which I have been meaning to uh, tidy up just a little bit, but we've got all the power supplies in this row here. Uh, obviously, there's a lot of cables here because obviously so many cards, but you know, these aren't warm at all. These are all cold. There's no issues with them before anyone starts asking. Not an issue at all. Everything is fine. Um, but I have, in a total, I have six power supplies. So this one here is a 1200 watt power supply. And I have five 1600 watt titanium power supply running all of these cards. Obviously, more so for the efficiency. Uh, and obviously, you know, I've got a fan just up here, which is obviously just grabbing that heat that's coming out and just throwing it up. These cards don't really get hot. I mean, we've had a few hot days where the, you know, the fan speeds may pick themselves up because I've got auto fan on. Um, and it just keeps them, you know, they're not actually hot. The fans are just getting a little bit loud, obviously, because we're running the turbo variant of the cards, as you can imagine. But look guys, that's not it. So I'm actually running about a total of 3.5 to 3.6 giga hashes. So in my normal computer, I actually also have a RTX 3090. Um, that also pushes about 125 hashes. And I've also got a um, another computer in there that's also running three RX 580s. And those are obviously making about 30 hashes a card as well. So that's pretty good. Uh, guys, look, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please let me know if you want to know anything else about my setup. Um, I'd be more than happy to answer comments. Uh, please don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe button, and notification bell if you did enjoy this video. And guys, I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching, and be safe.